Hey everybody, Rafine of Handicapping Thoroughbred Racing on Sunday afternoon, January the 8th, and this is my Echo Base Winter Circle East Coast Racing Report. A couple of stake races in action this afternoon, folks, at both Aqueduct and Gulfstream Park. Let's go to the Big A first for race 8, 3.46 p.m. Eastern Post Time for the Rise Gym Stakes. Six furlongs on Aqueduct's winterized inner dirt track. Four-year-olds and up racing for a stakes prize of some $75,000. Contenders number six, Frazzle. Number seven, Kaisha Electronica. Number three, JJ's Lucky Train. And number five, Ravallo. Number six, Frazzle has won five of nine in his career to date, sprinting at six furlongs on the dirt. Qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony. Is the pace profile leader. Has hit the board in power run fashion in four straight, including back to back to back power run wins in his last three starts. Jockey Ramon Dominguez has been in his honors on one previous occasion, posting a win on route to a positive 75% profit in the process. Is back here today at the Big A for a second ride, gunning for personal back-to-back -back circle trips. Number seven, Kaisha Electronica, the morning line favorite, takes a class drop of five units. The overall speed leader in this field, he's turned in power run performances in five straight, hitting the board in four, including back-to-back -back power run wins. In his fourth and fifth races back. Jackie Cornelio Velasquez and trainer Todd Pletcher sent him to the post. They fit the board with 63% of their entries saddled as a team to date. Race 8 summary, number 6, Frazzle, tops my contenders list, which also includes number 7, Kaisha Electronica, number 3, JJ's Lucky Train, and number 5, Ravallo. 6, 7, 3, 5 in the 8th from Aqueduct, the $75,000 Rise Gym. Stakes. Gulfstream Parks feature race 10, 4.45 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Ocala Stakes. Mile test on the dirt. Phillies and mares, four years old and up racing for $60,000. Contenders number four, all due respect. Number seven, Sweet Repent. Number three, Delightful Mary. And number one, Gorgeous Melody. Number four, all due respect, takes a class drop of two units this afternoon. The overall speed leader in the stakes field racing at her about today's distance of a mile on the dirt has hit the board in power run fashion in four of her last five, winning twice in this recent streak of racing consistency. Number seven, Sweet Repent, has won seven of 12 in her career to date, racing at today's distance on the dirt as the pace profile leader has hit the board in power run fashion in five straight, including back to back to back. Power Run wins in her second through her fourth races back. Jockey Fernando Yaha and trainer David Bradley send her post for today. They've whacked the toe board with 52% of their entries saddled as a team to date. Race 10 summary number four, all due respect, tops my contenders list today, which also mm -hmm. includes number seven, Sweet Repent, number three, Delightful Mary, and number one, Gorgeous Melody, 4731 in the 10th today from Gulfstream. The $60,000 Oak Collar Stakes. Bonus long shots, Sunland Park, race eight, the four to one shot, number 10, Major Billy, comes up back to back power run wins in his last two starts. Los Alamitos, race three, the eight to one shot, number one, Just Charmed, a track master plus power pony qualifier, takes a class drop of two units, nice speed for this four and one half for a long sprint. So from Aqueduct and Gulfstream Park, at on a Sunday afternoon, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.